Hi guys, good morning. This is Faithful with Elegance for Less. We are continuing our Mommy and Me series. So today we are going to do carrots. You will need your foam board from the Dollar Tree. You will need pencil, razor, and a knife in order to draw and cut out your carrots. So here is Shekinah and Catherine. We went ahead and cut out our carrots and you will need a plastic plate. You'll need paint. We're going with the orange acrylic paint and the yellow. You will also need your paintbrush and a cup of water to keep your brush clean. Now we are mixing our paint and we're gonna jump right into painting the center of our carrots. Now I must tell you, I have three Dollar Tree foam board and I wanted to use two for this project. So there is no measurement. You can create these as large as you want them or as small as you desire. So I used the one foam board to create the large carrot and then the other foam board, I created two carrots out of the one foam board. Now, if you don't have foam board at home, you definitely can use your cardboards. Now, I wanted to use the foam board because it's a little bit thicker and it would give me that look I was going for. But definitely use cardboard if that's all you have. Or just put this DIY to the back burner for now until you're free to move about. Then you can go to the Dollar Tree and get your foam board. I must also tell you that I saw this on Instagram and thought it would be a great project for us to do. So I shared it with Catherine and asked if she could draw it. She did a fantastic job at it and I'm so glad we chose this project for us to do together because it truly is beautiful. Once you're finished, you will need yarn, and I got this one from Walmart. You'll need your scissors, your glue gun, and your glue sticks. Now, if you don't have yarn, you can always use your twine and a Dollar Tree rope. Guys, I promise you, if you do this project, you will have so much fun. It was fun, and the end result is beautiful. I'm very happy with this DIY. I can say this is one of the most quick and easy inexpensive beautiful DIY we've done that I am so in love with.
So you outline your carrots all the way around and I decided to add an extra one so now you will have two outline of your yarn onto your carrot. I think it just gives it a really nice finish. Once you're finished outlining, you will need a triangle shape, foam board, and two strips. We're going to glue this to the back of our carrot in order for it to be able to stand up. Like I mentioned, there was no measurement. We just eyeballed it, created a stand. Obviously, the larger the carrot, the larger the stand. The smaller, one also had a small triangle. So here I am going to glue my triangle and put it in the center of my carrot. Make sure your triangle is down to the bottom of your carrot and then you want to line the sides and that's where these little strips come in. We're going to take the strips and put it on each side of our carrots. This is just to give extra support. Thank you guys so much for spending this time with me and the girls. I hope you're enjoying Mommy and Me. We have a few more DIYs before Easter to share with you guys. If you like the way that these turned out, give us a thumbs up and share the video with your family and friends. I hope that you will recreate this because it was fun and it is beautiful. Okay, I will see you on my next.